to 95.7 of A Tampa Bay Hip Hop and RV. Oh, I'm so proud. <laughs> Cheyenne Roberts is in the building. How you doing? Oh, I'm. I, that's the question I want to ask you. <laughs> chasing destiny. You are in the group. You are chasing destiny, and you are catching it. Yes, I am. And I just really appreciate you for supporting. Like, I really appreciate everyone in the city. How could we not? You've been in it for a minute, <laughs> and it's happening. Yes. Yes, so please. tell us, I, I was uh, taping my segment for daytime today, and they said that you had just left yes, over, at, over at Channel 8. Uh, she'll be on Friday, by the way, 10 o'clock, make sure you catch it. Okay. But y your journey has been really interesting. How did you end up on Chasing Destiny? Well, I actually auditioned for American Idol, and then I didn't get the cut for that. But they sent all my information to Kelly because they heard that she was doing a show and they thought I, I would be a good fit. And we got an email and... I audition and everything, you know. There, there it is. I, I can't believe that they, they didn't pick you for American Idol, but everything happens for a reason. Everything happens for a reason. And, and this is the path on, the, on your journey that yes. apparently was meant to be. Yes, and I really love it. Couldn't have a better mentor. You look Kelly. great on TV, by the way, but you look even more beautiful in person. Well, thank you. You look well in person. Thank you. We ain't talking about me. Look. We talking about you. <laughs> but we are super proud. What is that like? You you, you are representing for, for St. Pete, Tampa Bay, Florida. Well, I mean, it's great. I love doing it because I've been singing since I was two years old. So, like, I've always, this has always been my passion. So, repping for the city, like, we need that. Absolutely. And you've been saying since you were two, and you're still a baby child. Yes. I mean, I know you're grown, but you're still a baby child to us. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> there is a poster in in our back office that has Cheyenne, has your pretty face on there, <laughs> and it says Shody, which is a song you had prior yes. to, but that we've been supportive for a minute. Yes. Yeah, and we'll continue to be. Thank you. So who do you listen to? Um, who, who are you rocking right now? Right now, Drake. Right now. <laughs> um, Tori, Tori Lance, um, B, Beyonce, of course. Yes, get into a part yes. chat. And I, you know, our music. Yeah. The group. Of course. You know, we've been recording, so we've been working on our new sound and stuff like that. So. And speaking of your sound, I know you're creating a new sound with the group, but where did you get your sound? Who are you listening to coming up since you were two? Well, I listen to like Yolanda Adams. Um, Whitney Houston, Whitney and Yolanda were my first two songs that I that I learned. My mom actually told me, and um, and Beyonce. Yeah, and those were the people like I, that I listened to. I was like, okay, I want to perform like B, but I want to have the presentation like Whitney, and I want to have like the I want to get the feel like Yolanda. So, how long have you known this is what I'm going to do? This is my my passion. This is my path. This is my career choice. Since I was two. Wow! Since I was two, I I want to sing. I started singing. I've been singing since I was two, like I said, and I've been performing since I was four. So it's like it's always been there. And my parents sing, so it's like a I was supposed to do this. You were supposed, <laughs> supposed to do this. And, and it, I'm quite sure that being that you've been doing this for so long, that there have been moments where you questioned, "Am I doing the right thing?" What was the factor that kept you pushing forward? Well. Really, I would look at the hard work that my mom put into me. Like, you know, my mom stopped working be, you know, to help me pursue my dream. So I was like, I can't let her down. And then I can't let my fans down, the people, you know, the people that come up and, you know, actually look up to me. So I'm like, I don't do this just for me. I do this for everybody else as well. That's right. She's holding down the city. Today. She's holding down the fam. <laughs> but we are so proud of you. So of course you've got uh, the Chasing Destiny. And obviously they are are they have a stringent, a tight schedule on you. Yes. So you were saying that you at any minute you could get yes, called and you gotta go. go. <laughs> so how has this been so far? Is it, I know it's hectic. It's fast. It's really fast. But I love it. I've been preparing for it for all my life. So it's really fun. Like just to do wake up in the morning and know that you get to do something that you love that's the best feeling in the world when they were announced when Kelly was announcing <laughs> who made the group and of course the anticipation was crazy what were you thinking because your name was the fifth name called yes. out of five at first I was like okay I probably didn't make the group I thought she was gonna pick four because that's what they was talking about a little bit it was like three four maybe five 
And I was like, all right, okay, I'm gonna be okay. And then she was like, Cheyenne, I'm like, really? I made it the group. <laughs> I was excited, I was, I was like, okay. Let's work. I was ready to work. We were like, when we go into the studio. <laughs> right. And you all did go right away. Yes, Straight we away. did. Like the next day. So how are the young ladies? You all get along? Those you you feeling like, everybody? Those are like my sisters. I rock with those girls. Oh, already? Like, yes. That's we a click, blessing. We click very well. Like even like with our singing, like we don't have to like try. Like we could just be humming like the, like rolling or something like that. And we would just all come in and you like, oh wow. <laughs> like it's so nice. Though. Who who you're closest to? I'm close to all of them. Okay. Like really, like I talk because everybody gives something different. So like they kind of like if it's it's like you can't leave one of us out. Like you have to have all five because we bring like that black magic. Yes, yeah. black girl magic. Black and you're the baby, magic. right? Yes. The baby. I'm the baby. <laughs> <laughs> so what is next? Um, we're just recording, working hard. Um, you know, getting in shape, getting ready for, you know, wards and just ready to do everything, just bring to the next level. Okay, let me let me rapid fire. Favorite color? I don't have a favorite color. No? No. Okay. Favorite number? Five now. Uh, very that's right. <laughs> Good answer. Uh favorite food? Chicken. Check fried baked. All of it. <laughs> It doesn't matter, like literally it doesn't matter. Favorite pastime? Mm. Don't know. Favorite hobby? Singing. Okay. <laughs> Dancing. Uh favorite cartoon character? Mickey. Mickey! Ah. Okay. Three words to describe yourself. Passionate, ambition. So All right. Aw. What have I forgotten? What do we need to know about Cheyenne? That I'm never going to give up. And I'm going to always work hard, play hard. There it is. That's one of my miles. <laughs> work smarter, not harder. <laughs> so what is your advice for, for those that are coming up and have those dreams like you've had since you were two? Never give up. And to always love what you do and do what you love. It has been such a pleasure meeting you. Me too. It, it, I, we wish you continued blessings, continued success. There's no doubt in my <laughs> mind, in our minds, that you are destined to do great things. Thank you. Yay! Cheyenne! Woo! <laughs>